Hello everyone and welcome back to more Mass Effect 2. In the last episode, Commander, uh, we recruited uh, Kasumi and we spoke to Anderson. So right now, uh, we have one more dossier to get through. Um, yeah, where am I going? Yeah, we've got one more dossier to get through. And uh, then we can start on the loyalty missions. Uh, so, but before we do that, I really just want to quickly uh, catch up on some of my squad members. Because I haven't been speaking to them very much. So... Uh, let's go and talk to Garrus. In fact, we haven't spoken to Samara since she got here, so we'll just basically we'll go around all the squad members. Um, hopefully, this episode uh, won't run too long, but you know, it's got to be done. We can't ignore the squad members. Anyway, let's go talk to Garrus first. Put together an impressive team. I've never worked with so many aliens before. Hopefully he's actually got something to say instead of talking about his calibrations. I don't know. Alright, and you can probably tell I have got a cold. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Oh, fuck you. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. Okay, so we can't talk to Garrus, so let's just go and talk to the rest of them. Hopefully the rest of the squad members have got something cool to say. Right, crew quarters, nothing in there. Uh, starboard, on, yeah, there we go, there's Samara. Shepard. How are you? I've spent much of the last 400 years on my own. It is nice to have a colleague to chat with. I may be rusty at it, however. If you are patient, I would love to talk. How much do you know about our mission? I know that I've sworn an oath to follow you, and that you seek to destroy the Collectors. That is enough for me. You don't want to know why the Collectors need to be fought? When you live by a code that compels you to harsh action, you learn the dangers of curiosity. If I must kill a man because he has done wrong, do I really wish to know that he is a devoted father? I'd like to hear more about the criminal you were chasing on Nos Astra. I hope you will understand if I wish to avoid this topic. It is deeply tied to my code and beliefs. You might say it is personal. I need to know if this will impact the mission. It will not. What do you think of Cerberus? I've heard rumors. But learned long ago to form my own impressions. There is too much room for interpretation in the opinions of others. Why were you willing to work for Cerberus when you didn't have first-hand knowledge? I work for you, Shepard. Our methods may be different, but our goals are not. I should get back to work. It has been my pleasure, Commander. All right, then. Spoke to Samara. Um, I'm trying to remember where everyone is. Thane's in here. you need something? Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Not at all. Oh, upgrades. We need to have the best equipment possible to take on the collectors. Do you have any leads I could chase down? My old contact network often located rare equipment for me. Would you like me to get in touch with them? Let's see what they've got. Ship enhancements. Probe bay. Okay, that's cool. We'll get that. Thank you, Thane. Very helpful. Uh, there's Kasumi. Kasumi doesn't really talk. She's much like Saeed. She doesn't have her own dialogue. Um, like, you know, dialogue wheel. But there are loads of stuff around her room that you can have a look at. Uh, yeah. Kind of boring, really. People are talking out there. And I hear it all. Alright, okay. Whatever. Don't laugh. I like those books. Romance novels, crime novels, the classics. There's something about the feel of actual paper in your hands. Their musty smell. It's relaxing. Keiji used to find books for me while on the job. Some of these are more valuable than the objects he was hired to steal. Okay. Yeah, screw this, let's go. That's boring. Um, who else is on this level? God damn it. I think Miranda's on the level. Let's go talk to Miranda, see if she's got anything to say. 
If we have time, I'd like to go to Ilium and relocate my sister's family. I'll let you know, Miranda. Yeah, of course, okay. Miranda. I already spoke to her. Um, basically, we've got some loyalty missions to get through. Uh, we've got Kasumi's, Morden's, Jack's, um, Zaid's, uh, Jacob's, and Miranda's. Uh, we'll have some more to do after that as well, so. But quite a bit to get through, but, you know, we'll do it, because it's fun. Anyway. Right, let's go to the CIC and let's actually do something. Um, let's go and get Tally. Uh, wait, do I have any messages? Uh, Samesh Bhatia. Uh, yeah, he is on um, Mass Effect 1. Emily Wong, Mass Effect 1. And Denier. There we go. Alright, done. Damn it, didn't mean to do that. I meant to go to the mass relay, but I'm a dumbass. Alright, tally, 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 tally is over there. Haystrom. Right, so after tally, I think that's all the dossier is done. And we can get started on some loyalty missions in the next few episodes. I'm looking forward to it. The loyalty missions, in my opinion, are the greatest parts of the game. Um, besides the final mission, of course. But if you haven't seen that, I won't spoil it. Let's just say it is beyond badass. Um, Garrus, you can come with us. And, you know, fuck it, let's say Grunt. Why not? Um, yeah, I'm saving up. Saving up. Uh, do I really want the Matic now? I'm getting a bit bored with it, to be honest. Let's see if I can change my weapons. Uh, we have the Avenger, the Vindicator, Matic. Do you know what? Screw it, I'll just stick with the Matic right now. Um, this actually might be a good level to test out my arc projector. Because it will come in handy. Uh, the shotgun is fine. Um, yeah, these are all fine. In fact, now let's change Grunt Shotgun. He can use the Eviscerator. That's a cool gun. Okay. Alright then. My shields are dying. Hey, run. I'm having serious issues with my shield. So we'll fight from the shade, but no <laughs> 300 reference. Our arrows will blot out the sun. And we will fight in the shade. I like 300. 300 was a good movie. Heal us alive, bro. Right, let's head back out the gate. Oh, Geth dropship. Well, this is familiar, right? Because of shot ready. Charge them. Okay, let's maneuver around here. I love the noises the Geth make, it's really cool. Okay, sniper rifle. Let's try and pick these off from a distance. Yeah, god damn it, I missed. Should find an alternate path. The rope's digging. Crap, there's no shade. 
scrap. We are fucked. God damn it, just switch back to the assault rifle. Where's the shade? God damn it. That sucked. That was really stupid, I know. Right, let's try the sniper rifle again. No, not the shotgun, that's stupid. Don't use a shotgun. God damn it, how the hell did I miss that? There we go. Let's put armor piercing rounds on it. Yeah, I'm a bit rusty on the combat with Mass Effect 2 right now. I haven't played it properly in a while. Oh, come on, get out of the shade, man. Shield. Right. That could have gone better. Not gonna lie. It's been a while since I've actually done some combat, so. Uh... What the hell are they shooting at? Okay, we got a new submachine gun now. Cool. Up one, this is squad leader Kelrieger. Come in, over. This is Commander Shepard of the Normandy. Can we provide assistance? Patch your radio into channel 617 Theta. We're on a stealth mission, high risk. We found what we were after. The Geth found us. They've got us pinned down. Can't get to our ship. Can't transmit data through the solar radiation. How are you holding up? We can be there in a few minutes. Take it slow and careful. Direct sunlight fries your shields all to hell. We're bunkered down at base camp across the valley. I left Tally Zora at a secure shelter that doubled back to all the choke point. Getting Tally out safely is our top priority. If you can extract her, we'll keep him off you. You've got confirmation that the Geth haven't reached Tally yet? Affirmative. I'm the best man with her. When you get her, you can talk to her on the car. Every Marine on this rock is sworn to protect Tally Zora. As long as one of us is still drawing air, she'll be safe. Hold position. We'll hit their back ranks. Wait, watch your ass. We got a dropship coming in. Said there's charges out here. We can blow them. No more targets. Okay. Uh. Oh. No shield. There we go. Anymore. That's one demo charge. We need a core sample to get a timeline on the rate of radiation increase, but our equipment keeps dying on us. Shepard once used a mining laser to clear some rubble back on trail. Maybe I can do something similar. <laughs> Shit, we've got to get the prime. <clears throat> Oh my god, I hate Geth Prime so much. Enemies! Okay, ah uh, crap. 
Whoa, I am taking some heavy damage right now. Scratch one! Okay, we're cutting through these guys fairly easily. I need ammo. There we go. Perfect. Okay, are we heading down here? I'm assuming we are. Aha, yeah, there we are. Some power cells. Always awesome. Anyway, we found the explosives. Whoa, rocket troopers, I hate them. So annoying. But they're even more annoying on Mass Effect 3. I don't know why, but I just find them really, really frustrating. What? Whoa, that dude's just gone fucking commando and just attacking us. What a brave geth. God, that destroyer has got a lot of shields. I'll put them down. Okay, there we go, the trusty pistol. Reliable sidearm, I will say. Ah, my shields. Shade. I swear to God, I could make so many 300 references in this uh, walkthrough right now. We have to fight in the shade, quite literally, so... Um... Spartans! Nah. Never mind. Um, where the hell am I going? This way. Yeah, there's the pillar. I'm just I wasn't paying attention at all just there. I apologize. Send it to the sky. We might want to move. Get back. Seriously? Like the music hyped that explosion up, but it wasn't really that big. Okay. Execution. Boring sure. There's two words you don't expect to hear together. Why do we care? Anyone choosing to come here should be on their own. Ancient wall safe. Okay then, let's hack this. There might be something ancient in it. Wait a minute, Tally. Jesus. Only 6,000 credits. God damn it. Our ancestors walked these halls with uncovered heads. The sun must have been normal back then. Hello? Is anyone there? Tally, it's Shepard. I'm sorry. Everyone here is dead. Any survivors must have fallen back. We knew this mission was high risk. Damn it. And what are you doing here, Shepard? We're in the middle of Geth space. I was in the neighborhood. I thought you might need a hand. Thanks for coming, Shepard. It means a lot to hear your voice. Carl Rieger and what's left of the Marines got me into the observatory. From where you are, it's through the door and across the field. I got the data I needed, and I'm safe for now, but I've got a lot of Geth outside. It looks like somebody sealed the door against the Geth, and the console is damaged. Can you get it open on your end? Uh, let me see. Yes, I can do it. Here. Should be unlocked now. Be careful, Shepard, and please, do what you can to keep Rieger alive. Okay. Still don't have a whole lot of ammo for my assault rifle. We've been spotted. 
No fucking shit. <laughs> I swear to God, Grunt's battle cries are just hilarious. Yeah, there we go, got it eventually. Whoa! There we go. That's that one. It's me, Shepard. Get out of the way, then you retard. Stand there. Grunt, go over there as well. Yeah. Yeah. What did you say? Do as I say. Look at it right. What the hell? How much health this guy got? There we go. That took some doing. Oh, I can't go over there, God damn it! Run! Fight in the shade! Run! Whoa! Nearly ran into a Gath Prime. Rookie mistake right there. Let's bring out the big guns. Suck my testicle! There we go. Ah, uh, love the arc projector when you fight fighting Gath. Comes in so handy. My shields are down. Yeah, I know, and I'm being blinded by the sun. Oh, these guys. Remember these from the first Colossus. game? I hated these on the first game. This is why I follow you, Shepard. Big things. That's what she said. Ah! Well, crap. I saw that coming. I don't know why I didn't Over get out of the way. Get to cover. Green Lantern. Yeah. Is what? Yeah, uh, Cal Rieger's voice like there. Cal Rieger, Green migrant fleet marines. We talked on the radio before that dropship arrived. I still got no idea why you're here. This ain't the time to be picky. Callie's inside over there. The Geth killed the rest of my squad, and they're trying to get to her. Best I've been able to do is draw their attention. Are you sure she's still alive? The observatory is reinforced. Even the Geth will need time to get through it. <laughs> and it's hard to hack a door when someone's firing rockets at you. The Geth are near platoon strength, but the Colossus is the worst part. It's got a repair protocol. It huddles up and fixes itself. I can't get a clear shot while it's down like that. I tried to move in closer, and one of the bastards punched a shot clean through my suit. How bad is your suit damage? Combat seals clamp down to isolate contamination, and I'm swimming in antibiotics. Geth might get me, but I'm not gonna die from an infection in the middle of a battle that's just insulting. Any ideas on how to deal with the Colossus? Standard protocol with armature class units is to sabotage the shields and whittle it down, you know? Kill it with bug bites. But the repair protocol blows that plan to hell. You try to wear it down, it just huddles up and fixes itself. So whatever we do, has to scrap that bastard fast. Probably means getting up close, past that cover. We need to get to Tally. Got any ideas? Just one. I'm not moving so well, but I can still pull a trigger. I got a rocket launcher that the sun hasn't fried yet. You move in close. I'll keep the Colossus busy. Maybe even drop its shields. With luck, you'll be able to finish it off. You've done enough, Rieger. You don't need to throw your life away. Wasn't asking your permission. My job is to keep Tally safe. We don't have enough people on our side for you to take one for the team. Stand down. I'm not gonna stand there while you run into enemy fire. They killed my whole squad. And if you want to honor your squad, watch my back. I need you here in case they bring reinforcements. <clears throat> All 
right, Shepard. We'll do it your way. Hit him for me. Kill us alive. Time to fight. <clears throat> 19 Paragon. Cool. Mm. Wait, does that, does that make a dent in my... Uh... Nah. Never mind. Okay, <laughs> let's... Um... How's it going out there? No. You want to try it my way? I'll handle it. Your call, Did not mean to do that. <laughs> Run. On the ground, now! Bollocks. <clears throat> yeah, this is gonna go well, I'm sure. Okay. Run down here. This is where I normally go. Fight our way down here. Shields have failed. Shit. Run. Okay, so my plan is to use the arc projector on the Colossus. Look out! I'll put them through. There we go. Nicely done, everyone. I can hear bullets, like, firing, but I mean, I can't see any signs of any, you know, battle. Never mind. Let's go. You'll get Tally and get the hell off this planet. Just let me finish this download. Thank you, Shepard. If not for you, I would never have made it out of this room. This whole mission has been a disaster. I wish I'd joined you back on Freedom's Progress, but I couldn't let anyone take my place on something this risky. A lot of Quarians lost their lives here. Was it worth it? I don't know, Shepard. It wasn't my call. The Admiralty Board believed the information here was worth sacrificing all our lives for. I have to believe that they know what's best. I didn't ask what some Admiral thought. I asked what you thought. A lot of people died here. Some of them were my friends. All of them were good at their jobs. That damn data better be worth it. The price was too high. What can you tell me about your research here? Haystrom's sun is destabilizing. Back when this was a Quarian colony, it was a normal star. It shouldn't change that quickly. Any idea what's destabilizing the sun? If I had to guess, I'd say that it was dark energy affecting the interior of the star. The effect is similar to when stars blow off mass to enter a red giant phase. But Haystrom's sun is far too young for this to be natural. Whatever the reason, I'm glad I could help. Once you deliver that data, I could use you on the Normandy. I promised to see this mission through. I did. I can leave with you and send the data to the fleet. And if the Admirals have a problem with it, they can go to hell. I just watched the rest of my team die. Maybe not the whole rest of your team, ma'am. Rieger, you made it. Your old captain's as good as you said. Damn Colossus never stood a chance. If need be, the Normandy can get you out of here, Rieger. Ah, the Geth didn't damage our ship. As long as we get out of here before reinforcements show up, we'll be fine. Actually, I won't be going with you. I'm joining Commander Shepard. I'll pass the data to the Admiralty Board and let him know what happened. She's all yours now, Shepard. Keep her safe. All right, so we got Tally. Awesome. So, in the next episode, we can get started on some loyalty missions. I haven't decided which ones yet, but we'll decide at the time. Previous squad's weapons, but never mind. I always get interrupted whilst I'm reading. God damn it. Cerberus saw footage of you in action, Tally Zora. We're looking forward to having you on the team. Your engineering expertise will really benefit the mission. 
I don't know who you are, but Cerberus threatened the security of the migrant fleet. Don't make nice. That's why you're here, Tally. I need people who aren't Cerberus. People I can trust. I wasn't part of what happened to the migrant fleet. But I understand your distrust. I hope we'll get past that as we work together. I assumed that you were undercover, Shepard. Maybe even planning to blow Cerberus up. If that's the case, I'll loan you a grenade. Otherwise, I'm here for you, not for them. If it helps, check out the Normandy while you're here. We've gotten a few upgrades. I'll get Tali Zora the necessary security clearance to access our systems. Please do. I can't be part of your team if I don't know how the ship works. I'll be in engineering if you need me. Don't forget to introduce yourself to Edie, the ship's new artificial intelligence. Okay, so Jacob just got the uh, death stare. You do not fuck with that. Okay, so let me out the door, goddammit. My god, I just sound like Eric Carmen just then. <laughs> god damn. It. Okay, assault rifle damage. Let's get that up. Can I go any higher? Any more? Damn it. Oh. Okay, anyway, that's the end of the episode. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you later.